I am a retired nurse, an ordained minister. I do funerals, weddings, and I preach occasionally. Um, often people call me up just for counseling, and I do that pro bono. Nancy Scott is a kidney disease patient who was first diagnosed in 2004 and was on dialysis for eight years. I was walking down the street and everything was white outside. I could not uh, find my car. Two days after that, I could not walk. So I was taken to the emergency room and I went in and I just told the doctor, you know, I'm, I'm out of breath. I said, I think, you know, perhaps I put on a little weight. And um, my, he, he told me, uh, Ms. Scott, your hemoglobin is 5.8. He kept asking me, did I have kidney disease? And I said, no, I don't have kidney disease. That was on a Saturday morning, and by Monday morning, I was on dialysis. I started dialysis in 2004, and May of 2011, I got a kidney transplant. Nancy joined the Board of Dialysis Patient Citizens in 2007, where she has served as secretary, vice president, and president. When you know better, you do better. And the DPC Education Center allows you to not only interact with just dialysis patients, but you have the whole realm. You have the dialysis patient, you have the patient that is about to start dialysis, and then you have the transplant patient. It was a great day for us actually when Nancy came. She was a breath of fresh air. Um, when I talk about the education and being on board with your treatment, Nancy was all of that. Um, Nancy actually put her own needles in. Nancy knew what her dry weight was. She knew how to restrict her fluid. She was on top of her diet. She knew what she wanted her clearances to be when she was on that dialysis machine and she demanded that care and she received it. As I learned more about it, and begin to educate myself, I realized that dialysis does not mean the end of your life. It just means the end of your kidney function. And that is what I say all the time to new patients, old patients, everybody. So I've known Nancy for probably close to six years and um, we developed a relationship because she would be in her dialysis chair out on the floor calling me on her cell phone saying yeah, come on out here and take a look this isn't going exactly the way it's supposed to so she kind of really was an advocate for the other patients that were on dialysis as well as she helped train the staff. Beyond Nancy's involvement in Dialysis Patient Citizens and the DPC Education Center, she serves as a patient representative of the advisory board of ESRD Network 4 and chairperson of the Henrietta Johnson Medical Center. She has a real passion for patients um, and she just fit in with the community and she found a niche here at Henrietta Johnson Medical Center and we're glad that she's on our board. Now Henrietta Johnson treats people of all kinds, whether you have insurance or not. But the good thing about it is if you do not have insurance, that will not stop you from being treated in this facility. Miss Scott is a real go-getter. She's just a great person. She's just very well-rounded and, and I love her.